All right, all right, all right. Welcome back, you guys. We're doing JJ today. First game on is a hit Kiri. Let's see what we got. It's only rep two. Hit Kiri can be paying. Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> we're not fighting hit Kiri. Never mind. All right. We are, uh, yeah, we're not fighting hit Kiri. We're fighting a Shaolin, is what I meant to say for the first game. So, uh, yeah. Let's see what we got. Okay. Unlucky. Hmm. Missed that reaction. Okay, he goes for it. Let's see if we can let this first one fly. Okay, he parries it. And tell it already that he wants reactions. Okay, he didn't go for that. Why did I dodge? Man, I'm making every wrong read on this. Okay, he goes for it again. Oh, he did it twice. I feel like I'm about to get timinged. Not throwing any lights. I know he wants it, but okay. Wow, he missed it. He was doing a lot of, uh, you know, in between his, like, his attacking, he was doing a lot of standing perfectly still, you know? And, and that worries me. <laughs> Whenever I see a lot of standing perfectly still, I don't like it too much. I don't like it too much. He reacted to both my unblockables. Uh, first two out of the gate, so... I'm not sure if he uh, just isn't aware of where my skill is, and he he thinks maybe I'm I'm don't know how to feign or something. Okay, I didn't think that would reach if I'm being honest. Pairing all yeah, reacting all every single one. Okay, feigned the very first one for some reason. Let's see if we can get him on the wall here. If he's just gonna keep reacting. Then okay, of course he doesn't react to that one. Hello. There we go. Yeah, he's just reacting to way too much. Nice parry. Okay, nice. I, I didn't, par I didn't parry that. What? What? What did I parry? Did I not click the parry button? I don't know how I didn't parry that. I, 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 I clicked the parry button on it. I thought. Okay, that's unfortunate. All right, we have another case of I don't know how to open. I swear, like so many characters in this game, just I feel so unsafe just opening with. JJ's one of them. All he's got is heavy, light, and bash. Yeah, I can tell he wants it, but what else am I going to open with? He's going to dodge it, because, but, you know, what else do I open with? <laughs> cool. Sick. You want to light me for once? There we go. There we go. Frame advantage. Yeah, he is so scared to throw a light. There we go. Yeah, I just kind of have to play this a little bit slower and 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 make him be the one that opens, you know, uh, because I'm I'm, you know, I just don't I just don't really have a whole lot to open with. If I try to go for my bash, he can option select it, and I have to make a read whether he's going to option select it, so I could just dodge forward and do nothing, um, and and go for the the dodge attack, or I can just dodge forward and GB, but it's unsafe because of that right there. So, and then I GB again, and I get so that's that's two timings uh, right off the rip. He just, he's reacting to a ton of this stuff. There we go. Let's see if we can get him on the wall here. Yeah, we should be able to get a side heavy still on this. I, I just, just take the, just take the parry, man. <laughs> just take it. Just, okay. Take the parry. Take the parry. Take it. Take the parry. Okay, he, he missed it. Thank goodness. <laughs> I was scared to throw lights the entire time because I could tell he was just fishing for those parries. But... We got lucky because he missed him. GG, man. GG. All right. So uh, he clicked find new opponent and then we found him again immediately after. So I'm just going to go for a dodge for GB. Yep. 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 Light him out of this. He doesn't let much fly uh, from neutral. I tried to guard break. Why are you able to delay that so much? I wonder. Mm, I have just been timing every time. Okay. See if he's still going for everything. I didn't parry it? I don't know what's going on with me today. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. That's the second time now I had a free parry that I've missed it. He's probably going to react to this. Oh, he's not. Guard break. Frame advantage. He parries it. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, so I, I just really don't think I can really open against this guy. He's, he's being a bit too passive. 
And every time I go for a bash, I, end up, I just get punished for it. I'm trying to be aggressive, but my moves are just too slow from neutral. So I'm just gonna have to, I'm just gonna have to basically stare, unfortunately. I, I just don't really know what else to open with. He's got enhanced light, so he can at least open up with a top light and get into his, uh, his mix up. I don't even have that, so. Okay. Nice parry. And he just parried two in a row. Okay. Is he going to dodge attack this time? Yep. There we go. Yeah, we're just going to have to sit and be a little bit more patient from neutral in order to deal with this guy because, uh, you know, it's just difficult. It's just difficult. Open it up with JJ. I guess I could try doing the little dodge shenanigans that everybody else does to me. I just feel like whenever I try, it doesn't work. <laughs> you know, like, I don't know why, but I just feel like it doesn't work whenever I do it. But I'll try it. Maybe I could use that as an opener. Is that working? Is that actually working? Back step frame advantage. Okay. I didn't even try to dodge his bash. I just, I just wanted to... Okay, well now he's just reading it. Okay, he should be out of stam here. We get a heavy here, I think. Yeah, there is the dodge attack again. He got scared once again. Made the read that he was going to do the dodge attack. Yeah, that's the, that's the whole thing with unblockable mix-ups, guys. That's the whole thing. You just got to basically read what your opponent is going to do to respond. And a lot of the time, guys, people aren't going to be going for parries or stairs. They're not going to either just stare at it or parry it. A lot of the time, they're going to do something else like light interrupt, dodge attack. You know, if they make the read that you're going to faint, they'll do a light interrupt. If they make the read that you're going to let it fly, they'll do a dodge attack. So it's just feigning and baiting. Yeah, we're going to get him on the wall just to drain a little bit of extra stamina. Same damage. There we go. He just he just reacts to every single one. There we go. Same thing. Hopefully he doesn't slide off this wall. He probably will watch. Oh, he didn't. He's going to go for it again. Okay, no. And we're just going to let this fly. Good read on that. And that should be it. Yeah, we're just going to take that guaranteed 16 damage for the win. And we got the dub, baby. Good fight, brother. Good fight. Thanks. You're so very, very welcome, brother. You're so very welcome. All right. We have a new opponent. It is a Berserker. I struggle with Berserker, man. I struggle with Berserker. Let's see how we're doing. Let the first one fly. Okay, he goes for that one. See if he goes for an interrupt or something. See if we can hit him with this frame advantage. He goes for the deflect. Don't get it in time, though. Backstep frame advantage. Yep. Guard break him. Frame advantage again. Ooh, nice. There we go. Alright. Did pretty good with the reactions there. We didn't have to worry so much about his faint lights because we have hyper armor from neutral, like I said. So I, I kind of just saw that he was going to be going into his chain and I was like, you know what? If he wants to hyper armor me with a light attack, that's fine. We'll just get the trade. I'll get one of these bad mamma jammas. And I'll just come out on top as far as the health goes. So just tank them lights. Don't even have to worry about reacting to them. But I am going to try to react to them. I am going to try. Hmm. That was really unlucky. That was really unlucky too. Doesn't go for the parry. Okay. Here we go. We got him to dodge. Nice. Nice. There we go. That is a heavy man. He's got a wall to his back. Hopefully we can get this to land. Backs up heavy. Safe. Light him here. Unfortunate. There we go. He went for the deflect. We got it. Okay. I don't do heavy faint lights very often because like, I feel like most PC players can just counter it. Um... Because they can just react. It's like, and a lot of people do heavy faint lights, so uh, I normally don't do it. But every once in a while, whenever I just feel like my offense isn't working from neutral, I will I will do that. Unless it's like a really really good player, because then it's just impossible to hit them with anything. Hmm. See if he goes for a default. Oh, I don't know why he did that. Can I get this? Let it fly. It's undodgeable. Doesn't work. 
That was really unlucky too. Nice. That was really good. I'm just I'm just predicting at this point. Light him here. Yeah, before he can get into his hyper armor. Backstep heavy for safety. Okay. Probably gonna parry at that time, yeah, figured. Hmm. Oh man, that guard switch really got me, dude. That guard switch really got me. Oh man, I, I preemptively like moved my guard because I just got a little bit nervous. My nerves got to me and I just moved it just the tiniest amount. As soon as I moved it, he threw the light and I couldn't get back in time. I need to just get in the habit of keeping my guard where it is and just reacting, but I didn't that time. There we go. Man, he hasn't let a single one of these fly yet. Okay, there we go. Guard break him here. Nice. Great advantage. Figure he might parry it. No, nope, he's too low on stamina to have the guts. Backstep heavy. Light him. Guard break. There we go. I just clicked heavy. And of course he does it and I didn't even try. That is okay. That is okay. I didn't even try reacting to that unblockable. I was like, dude, he literally has not thrown a single one the entire game. I'm just not even going to worry about getting embarrassed, you know, but I got hit by it anyways. Good fight, man. That was a tough one. GG. All right. We have a rematch and he, he whipped out the warden, man. This is the best way to deal with reactionary players, man. You, you pick these un, these unreactable heroes like this. I'm going to start off with this because it's really stupid to do. I let the first one fly last time, so I figured he was going to uh, punish that, but Let's see if he does a light and makes the read. Okay, he doesn't. All right. I was almost really unlucky again. With that fly. Backstep heavy. Yep. That was really unlucky as well. There's so much uh, weird stuff that happens in this game, guys. <laughs> There's so much weird stuff that happens in this game from from timing to like you're trying to make a read so you do something and then they just do the just the right thing at just the right time it's just you'll just get hit by i mean i don't know if you're an aggressive player and you actually like to click buttons you're, you're you can lose to anybody that's just i've said it a hundred times i know but the only way that you can't lose to anybody is if you uh if you just stare and play optimal that's the only way that you're ever going to be able to uh look at my stamina <laughs> guys what have i done to lose that much stamina seriously tell me Nice parry. Oh, I thought he was going to bait out a light parry. Do I get two heavies here? Or do I just get one? I think I only get one. Nice read. Crush a counter. Wow, that was completely unguard breakable. That was so unlucky. Ooh, we baited it out, baby. Okay. Yeah, I did that dodge forward GB trying to mix him up with my bash, and he just happened to do a, a dodge forward GB himself. Uh, or maybe it was just a GB, I don't know. But it was at the very end of my dodge. I figured I'd be able to counter guard break, but it must have been last frame or something. I wasn't able to counter guard break that. Crazy enough. Just that was just the timing. That was just the timing. I decided to push a button and I took a risk. He doesn't light out in, light out very much. Here we go. Three crushing counters. Yep. Oh, I thought he baited out that time. Probably gonna do another one. No. Backstep heavy. Oh, and that is it. That was just enough damage. 16 points of damage, and we got the win. I made a lot of good reads on that warden there. Good fight, brother. Good fight. All right. We got another rematch. He's a solid player, so I wanted to give it to him. He picked Valkyrie, though. More unreactables, baby. More unreactables. He's going to go into his bash here. Yep. Backstep heavy. 
He could have done his dodge forward. Uh, oh, that was unlucky. Okay, no crushing counter there. Let that fly. He hasn't been reacting. Oh, there's a light interrupt. Probably going to parry this. Really obvious, but... Oh, wow. That was that was weird. That was really unlucky. He must have go tried to go into his dodge forward uh, full guard thing, but I just hit him. I must have just hit him right at the perfect time. I figured that if he did do that, he would have he would have been able to block it and get a guaranteed punish. But I must have just hit him like a frame before he got into the uh, into the uh, guard portion of it. There we go. Nice. Ooh. Did that a little too early. Nice. Figure he's going to go into his, uh, his all guard here pretty soon. Okay, we made the read that he wasn't going to do a crushing counter there. He, uh... He's trying to utilize the crushing counters and stuff, but we just we just made every right read on it so far. Lucky us. Love to see it. Round three. I assume he's gonna try doing a heavy into his full guard again, since uh, I haven't actually tried going for a GB in the middle of one of his heavies in a minute. I was unlucky there. Let that fly. Nice parry. He's probably gonna do it here. Nope. Unlucky. Let's see if he blocks this. Okay. Oh, nice. I was really unlucky, too. Okay, I just gotta play safe, because... Oh, man, every time I click a button, I'm getting hit by this. I'm just gonna keep going for GBs. Ah, uh, he does it immediately. Uh, I tried to timing him out of that. That is so difficult. I'm not really sure what to do. I tried doing some like instant GBs to catch him going into that, but you know, as it goes, uh, both the times I did instant GBs, he didn't do it. And then as soon as I stopped GBing, he started doing it. Okay. Maybe I should try utilizing my bash a bit more, but you can dodge out of it. That's the only thing. Yeah, see? Let it fly again. Nice. He parries that, man. I have fainted that so many times. I can't believe he's... Okay. Stop. Oh, wow. Okay. We got it that time. I'm surprised he wasn't doing uh, faint to GBs. I don't think he did very many fainted GBs that entire game, or if he even did it at all, actually. So I could kind of, now that I think about it, I kind of could have, could have just been doing that dodge attack the entire time, probably. Good fight, brother. Good fight. All right, we have the last fight of the video here, and it is a new opponent. Squidward's what? <laughs> Got a gladiator. I didn't mean to dodge backwards. I meant to dodge sideways like that, but that is a-okay. He's gone for the last two. See if he goes for three in a row. He sure does. See if he goes for a toe stab here. I don't know why. I just did that on movement like a dummy. Throws me to the wall. Gonna go for four in a row. No, sir. Free advantage. Wasn't gonna be surprised if he... Uh... Okay, wow. Wasn't gonna be surprised if he toe stabbed uh, whenever I had frame advantage. That's one thing that does suck about fighting Gladiator. Uh, if, if you're a frame advantage abuser like myself, uh, that, you know, that toast tab will just completely interrupt you. So you kind of just got to make a read whether they're going to sit still or, you know, there's a lot of things you got to take into consideration when, whenever utilizing the frame advantage against gladiator, he could zone, he could toast tab. Do it again. That was just unfortunate. It's going for so many unblockables. People are just going for unblockables today, man. Ooh, thought I dodged that. Mm, parried that a bit late. I was worried about my stamina there. Uh, I'm just messing everything up now, huh? the heck? Okay. Don't know why I just zoned from neutral. We get a guard break on that. Frame advantage. Okay, not parrying that. Frame advantage. <laughs> He's got to parry it eventually, right? 
There's that dodge bash again, and we got the execution. Yeah, you gotta be careful dodge bashing on Gladiator, man. It is very punishable. It is damaging punish. Victory. Got these Gladiator players out here that are used to, back in the day, whenever you could just option select basically every move in the game with this dodge bash. <laughs> and uh, it was not fun to fight against. It was not fun. So, Round three. can no longer do that. Gotta use your brain a little bit more. Thank goodness. Okay. See if he toe stabs. I assume he's gonna toe stab. Yep. Oh, he didn't chain. Okay. Mm hmm. Okay, we can punish it with that, though, luckily. He is reacting to a ton of unblockables. Light him. Nice parry. Oh, reacted slow to that. For aim advantage. Still not parrying that. This guy just does not parry heavies. Oh, he's a little slow there. For aim advantage again. I mean, I'm just gonna keep letting it fly until he starts parrying it. Didn't react to that. Oh, that was a good move. Mm, I didn't even look at that unblockable when I should have. Let her rip. You're gonna light me. Light me, do it. Do it. I dare you. Dare you. Dare you. Dare you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. That is gonna wrap it up. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. You know, hey. Gladiator, you're just not the play sometimes. But if you did enjoy, please like and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one. GG, brother. GG.